So before you start writing, the first step you're going to do with Continent Scale is to add a project. Once you're logged in, you can create as many projects as you want. As you can see here, I have 14 different ones and they're going to be for one website. So one project per website. So let's say we're going to create a project for this website, Test Gorilla, where maybe they're a client of ours, or maybe we are partnering up on creating their content. So here's how we want to do that. So we're going to click the create project button. And this is where we're going to add all of the details. So we're going to add the project name, which is just their company name. We're going to add their website. In the project context, we need to describe what this website does. So I often go to the homepage tagline right here, and I will actually rewrite this and put this in the project context. But if you don't have a website live, you just want to summarize what this website will be all about. So at test gorilla, we our talent assessment screen identify the best candidates. Okay, so then our audience, we want to think about who our audience is. So these are companies looking, these are applicants and companies because they serve both groups. If you know your audience, you know, you want to be specific and put that here, companies and candidates. Hire or get hired. So authoritative is a good tone of voice. Another good one is informative, but you can pick your own as well as type it in. So that's all we need to do. We can select how many posts we're going to do per month here, but you can always come back to this and change it later. So you could just leave it one for now, or if you know the exact amount, put it in there and then you can select the language you're going to primarily write in and the word count. But I generally leave these um, areas alone because I will pick the word count range directly whenever I write a post. So that's how to add a project in continent scale.